Hey everyone, this is Sean, and today I'd like to talk about how to use your Surface or Windows tablet as a second display for your laptop or desktop PC. So all you have to do is in your action center, press the connect button, and then you should see a list of all your computers or devices that you can connect to. In this case, my Surface Pro 3 is this item over here. So I'm gonna go ahead and select that. It'll ask me for permission whether or not I want to connect. So I'm gonna go ahead and click yes. And boom, now this is connected to this device. So now, if I wanted to, I can actually use this as a second display and all of a sudden, my Surface Pro 3, or really any Windows uh, tablet or laptop, is now a second display to my main display. Now what happens if I put my screen on a different side of my laptop or device? Well, the, the tablet doesn't actually know where it is relative to your screen. So if I go this way, you can see it's still coming in on that side. So to fix that issue, all you have to do is you've got to right click your desktop, go into your display settings, and then here you can see your first and second screen. All you do is just drag your second screen to approximately where it is in real life, hit the apply button, and now all of a sudden, your screen should be in approximately the right place. So now if I go and drag this over here, boom, now you see everything is uh, looking pretty good. Okay, so now I've disconnected on your device that you want to connect to or the device that you want to be your secondary display. Just go into settings by hitting the Windows button and pressing on the gear icon. Go into your system and under your system you'll have many different options. You want to uh, select the projecting to this PC option. Now if you don't see this option it's possible that either A your device doesn't support it most devices do, most Windows tablets will support this. So most likely uh, a problem might be that you're not running the latest version of Windows 10. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and select projecting to this PC. There are several options. The first option is asking, when can you project to this PC? Uh, available everywhere? Available everywhere on secured networks or always off? By default, I believe this is set to always off. So by default, you probably will not be able to connect to your laptop. So you need to go into your settings, go into projecting to this PC, and select either available everywhere or available on secure networks. Um, I select available everywhere because that's the easiest option. All right, so asking to project to this PC. So you saw earlier uh, when I asked to project to this PC, a little pop-up notification came and I had to select the button yes. So you can actually make it so that after the first time of asking, it'll never ask again. It'll automatically always just connect. Uh, in my case, I want to always be asked every time I get a connection. Now, if you're worried about security, you can add in additional layers of security by asking for a pin before uh, connecting, or you can also uh, select if you're worried about uh, battery power. In this case, I wanted it to connect all the time. You can see this is actually completely wireless, no wires, and it was connected to the, to the second display. So I always set this to off so that whether or not it's on battery, it can always connect. All right, so there you have it. That is how you can connect your Windows 10 tablet to your laptop or desktop PC as a second display. It's super easy. Windows 10 makes it super simple. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like it. Let me know in the comments below if you have any questions and thank you very much for watching.